Almost there. Yes. That took forever. Hello all and welcome to episode 20 of Nostalgia, which is a little late, but sorry. And this is pretty much the finale, so yeah. Woo. So in this episode, we're going to be finishing crafting the quantum armor and then going and destroying the ender dragon because it's not really that hard. So to do that, first off, we need a whole, whole bunch of UU matter. Because you need you matter to make iridium, which you need to make iridium plates, which you need to make quantum armor. We already have about a half stack of it. And if I come and flip this on, and flip this on, and produce even more lag, because tech it is lagging. Look at this. Look at the screen tearing, which you probably can't see, but it's bad. That goes pretty quick. But of course, you can speed it up a little bit by grabbing that charging bench, plopping it down there, throwing you in here, and a little lever. And as you can see, this is going pretty fast. Of course, I can't actually put that down there. Random pieces of sand. Now it's going significantly faster. Because now it's feeding off of the Lapatron crystal. And we will have to see whether it can actually keep up. It might just barely keep up. Hopefully. So we'll see about that. Hopefully I'll be able to keep up. This. I wonder if this is actually draining. Yeah, this is draining slightly. And then down here, we've got a pretty decent buffer of fuel since that was running the entire stream. Still got plenty of oil. These are all running full time. Awesome. I don't think they're actually going to heat up. And that's down to 90, so that one is draining, and of course this one's also draining quite a lot. But you're getting a pretty decent amount of UU matter, which will come into play a bit later. But first, we have to craft some of the other materials while we're waiting, I suppose. So first off, we can go ahead and grab the prerequisites for the Iridium Plates. Which there are... 2... 6... 8... 10 Iridium Plates in total needed. Each of those requires 4 Iridium, which each requires 7 UU matter. So it requires a pretty decent amount. For each of these, we need a diamond. So we're going to need 40 diamonds. We even have 40 diamonds. Hmm. Well, that might be a problem. I might have to use some of these. Yeah, I may just have to equip and exchange some stuff because the auto miner is still down and I still haven't actually had time to fix it. So, yeah. Whippy. Let's let's do that. Hey look, convenient diamonds. The, the auto miner probably would have gotten most of if it was actually auto mining, which I moved it too far forward, so at the moment it's not doing anything. I don't know. I might come back and end up actually rebuilding this. Who knows? But I have enough diamonds now, so yay. And yeah, diamonds. So, now we need a whole bunch of advanced alloy. Like, a whole, whole bunch. As in, like, let's just make a couple of stacks because it'll probably be used. Let's see, it's, no. That should be 10, 10 bronze and refined iron, okay. So, if I want three stacks, it's three to one. So, I'd want a stack and a half of copper, plus half a stack of you. And this is the fastest method to do it, so let's just do that. Then, three stacks of tin. Not redstone, tin. 
go. And how much iron do I have? Oh, uh, yeah. And let's melt that up with the speed of a very fast furnace. And can also come down here and check on Mass Fabricator, see how it's doing. It's doing pretty well. It is keeping up, although the Lapitron Crystal's dead, so let's go charge that up and pull some more power out of the main buffer of the house. Since it's not exactly being used for that much right now. There we go. Let's see how fast that drains up. Brass and bronze are intercompatible, right? Hmm. I think so. Are they? Maybe. Oh dear. Ah. Pause. Yep, okay. Noth nothing happened there at all. That's just gonna go in there. Yep. Pay no attention to that. And let's just wait for that to go. And there's weed. What else can we work on? Let's see. I suppose we can go ahead and make the advanced circuits. We need two. Two. Two of those. Let's get some of that. Some of that. Let's see if I can actually remember how to do this. Okay. There we go. Two of those. Already have all the nano suit stuff. Another Lapatron crystal. Okay, so we need four Lapatron crystals. So we need eight electronic circuits. Make sure this is good. You almost. Let's melt. We are almost done. Then copper will start. Come on. Come on. Come on. There you go. And let's just wait for that to finish. And make some circuits. There we go. Got the Lapatron crystals. This should be almost done. It's getting there. And then we need to go and make a couple of rubber boots, which I should have enough rubber for. Two of you. Pull that out of there. Are you almost done? Almost. Wait for that to finish. There we go. And then that can all be put in here. And that's a significantly smaller amount of bronze dust than I thought. Oh. That's one stack. Haha. <laughs> oh dear. So we need a full stack of that. We need one, two, three. This is going to take a long time. Sure. It requires a whole, whole bunch of copper and stuff. Yeah, let's just cut through this system. And with a couple of simple modifications, this can be set up to automatically process all this, as it will pull it all out. Or at least as much as that was supposed to be. Oh well. But yeah, some, something like that. And bring it all in here and just massacre it. And I may actually be able to pull one of these out and be able to pull a little more power without killing everything. Let's see if I can or not. So the system can't support running any of the machines at the same time with the same amount of power. 
But it may be able to power just one machine running at full power. Except not that one. Okay. So that's about as fast as that's going to go with this current system. Whoopee. That's pretty fast. So let's just see, is this done? Yep, there you go. And then we should just be seeing some dust show up in here eventually. There is some copper dust there. It should actually be showing up right here. Come on. Don't prove me wrong here. There you go. Now it's all showing up. And by changing the settings, it just tells it to put ingots into the macerator and then send dusts to the output chest instead of the normal configuration. And then that way done in a pretty rapid pace. And in the meantime, we can actually grab these four Lapatron crystals and put them to some use by coming up, pulling even more power out of this thing. And now that we've got all those charged, you can drop back down. And it looks like that's already done. Awesome. And as you can see, this is almost completely out. So just throw all of these in here and get a crazy amount of power. Is this actually sustaining now? Looks like it. Yes, it is. How are we doing on the fuel? It's still going up. Okay. So this works quite well, except for the fact that it's actually still eating stuff. Okay. And there we have a stack. And now we just let that run for a long time. Yeah. <clears throat> so, after a very, very long time, like, this thing takes a long time, even all of the stuff. Good grief. We finally have the amount of U matter we need. Gah. This is actually, like, a week later, so... Yeah... Time. Back to where I assume we probably were. Okay, so... First off, now that we have a whole bunch of U matter, you put it in an eye shape, and you get Iridium which in later versions is actually available through other means, but not here. Yay, I counted right. <clears throat> and then you need... Let's see, so that's two. You need ten. Four. Five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Math. And those iridium plates are made with a diamond. Advanced alloy and iridium ore. We have enough diamonds. Those go there. Those go there. I'm not really sure why I thought I needed 40 diamonds. I'm sure I had a reason. There you go. And we need some Lapatron crystals. And some machine blocks and glowstone, which I guess I don't already have. Oh well. I don't know why I need to do that stuff. First off, boots. Need the nano suit boots that it already came with. Those go there. That goes there. This one goes here. 99% sure you don't need it to be charged. Nope. But it will actually keep a little bit of the charge from the boots, which is convenient. There you go. And then the leggings, which need some machine blocks for, which I guess I can just use this since I... I don't know why I thought I needed that much. Oh well, now I have a whole bunch of extra. Maybe I can make some more solar panels or something like that. That need those maybe. Yeah, that goes there. Close down. There and there, and then nano suit legs and quantum suit legs. I really wish that they were black, but unfortunately they are not. So, and then they start getting a bit more complicated. Need the chest plate, which is like that, 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 that. And the chest plate's not actually in here. Wrong way. There you go. Chest plate. And lastly, the helmet, which actually has the most parts. So you need reinforced glass. I already made those. Which is just some glass with some advanced alloy. I already have some glass. 
And that just goes like so with some advanced alloy. And you get some reinforced glass. This stuff is also useful in building reactors and anything that can't explode because it's extremely explosion resistant. Unfortunately, I never got a reactor built, so... Yeah, oh well. Uh, oops. Those, not diamonds, those go there. And lastly, the helmet. Goes there. And now we have a quantum suit. And it's basically indestructible. Once you charge it. Which I very well may have completely discharged that. I pretty much did. Okay, let's try this one. Let's see how much I kill that. This is a Mark III. I should be able to charge this, right? Probably. No. Well, I guess on the bright side, I can come down here and use, like, the super uber charging bench. Which... Let's move that. You need to go... Literally anywhere that doesn't have a resonance signal because explosions are bad. And charge. Yeah, we're gonna be here for a really, really long time. Joy. Yeah, we'll get back to that. Okay, now we're good. Good grief. That took a long time. Come on. And now, if we can find the jetpack, there it is. No. We are pretty much invincible. Which is kind of one of the good and bad things about Quantum Armor. Because it's basically invincible. We Alright, this is the highest point of this thing. Whee! All good. Lots of mobs, oh my goodness. What happened? Okay, I don't actually know why there's that many mobs. I'm kind of scared now. I don't... okay. Hmm. I think this has to be dealt with. And there's creepers, so I don't think it's going to be dealt with that way. Well, now that that's dealt with, let's go find the end portal. So, macerate a couple of these using one of the somewhat famous glitches, which basically can provide you with infinite EMC, which is great, and one of the reasons that this is so stinking overpowered. And got some Iron Avengers. One more. Hopefully, there will be enough. You can go in here, and I'm gonna bring a couple of diamonds as emergency fuel in case I need them. I should have uh, one of those things somewhere. I know I have one. Where did I put it? Ah, here it is. That was quite a ways away. So sad that this thing never actually got fixed. I'm sure I'll fix it again eventually. And with those in case of emergency, that should really be it. And in that case, let's go and find the Ender Dragon. Eventually. Well, the jetpacks are more useful for that. Which direction are you? Where did you go? That away. I want that back. Did it blow up? Where'd it go? Curses. Oh, it's here somewhere, right? I guess I shouldn't go that high. And I believe... Oh yeah, that's the other thing about quantum armor. It's really fast. Yay! Unfortunately, it only applies when you're actually touching the ground, so it doesn't work when you're flying, which stinks. But oh well. At least it's fast whenever you're touching the water. And it actually works in water. So, that too. Okay, which way are you now? You're still that way. You're really gonna make me go through the ocean. 
Okay. Yeah, we'll find it eventually. We Found it. I, I should stop doing that. I'm gonna lose them all. I can get out quick. Don't dig straight down. Unless you have a jetpack and virtually invincible armor. Ooh, copper. Uh, what key is that? No. That's not it. You? There we go. Now uh, we have that. Come on. Come on. Come on. I hear doors. Hey! Hi! Anything else? Okay. Uh, am I gonna get lucky and find it easily? No. Okay, I guess... Hi. Well, I guess I'll just explore and find that. There we go. That wasn't too bad. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna get rid of you. And there are none. Well, that's why I brought this thing. Okay, let's block all of this off so that hopefully I don't get assassinated or something like that. Because, you know, that would be bad. Assassinations are bad. And let's see here. Okay, put you away. Put you away. Shut up, you. No one likes you. Go away. I didn't put that in there right yet. There we go. Okay. Did I just put the last one of those in there? Who oh, knows? Hmm. Well, I got I got that. Uh, what about fuel? Hmm. That's that's problematic. Can I, can I get these back? No. Okay, we're gonna run all the way back and get that. There we go. Okay. Are you in there? There we go. Place powder. Awesome. Get some of you. And let's just pull all this out so that you will stop. You go in. Keep you. Come on. Uh, you, 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 you. Uh, let's just put those together like that. You. Yay, glitch. You. No, not fuel. This thing. There you go. Uh, so I need, like, that many more. Right. Math. Did I math? Okay, I clicked that. Good. Okay, you, you, you. Is that it? Ta da! There you go. Okay. Okay, let's put all this essential stuff away. You, you, don't really need any of this. Uh, probably do want some blocks. <laughs> That's not exactly the best. <clears throat> all the you. Uh, water might be useful if I really need it. Hmm, anything else? Uh, fire is just a bad idea in general. Uh, let's get a mining laser, because mining lasers are cool. Anything else of use? I don't think a chainsaw is going to do me any good. Or a bucket of oil. Or paint. I think I'm going to paint them to death. Okay, that should be fine. And got you. I don't think I have an exchange in here anymore. No, I don't. Okay, let's just hope that I don't need the jetpack and it doesn't run out of power, otherwise sad things. Okay, so we got a mining laser. We got a drill, which I should go ahead and recharge. You. There you go. Now it's recharged. Okay. You're gonna do that. Awesome. Okay. So. Kalabanga! Doink. I should probably change that. Oh, seriously? Okay. Jetpack. Yeah, I'm not dealing with this, sorry. Ha 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 ha. Poke. 
Yeah. I'm not gonna deal with that. Over here. There we go. Uh, change you. Back. There you go. Okay. Uh, normal armor. Yippee. Anyone gonna attack me? No? Good. This thing is mostly charged. I actually probably want to charge this all the way real quick. I did pick it up right here. Okay. Let's wait until he's not gonna be over here so that I don't lose stuff, because that'd be bad. <clears throat> okay. You gonna fly away? Ra ping ping bye okay now quickly you go here you go there blink 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 you go there now this is fully charged break you before it breaks me okay we're all good yippity doo dah where'd you go and now I can you missed actually I'm just gonna kinda clear out some of them over here so I don't get as many angry at me hi hi Does he even hurt you? Hey. Hey. Just to point out, they literally do nothing. All this armor's OP. There's also not going to be a cuts in the fight, so if you don't like just boring fighting scenes, then... Well, you can play things at high speed, right? All the Ender Pearls. <clears throat> I do love how it's green. It's not a slime. Ah, ah! That did not help. They all missed. Oh dear. Okay. Hi. Hi. Hi there. Ah! Come back here. I want to make you go go bye bye. Ah! Well, that did nothing. Ah! What? You are not helping. Auto target. Oh gosh, run away. Ah! Auto targeting is being a very bad thing. I really wish Pahamar would have made it so that it prioritizes a more powerful boss. It's really annoying that squids and junk. Ah, oh, darn. That squids and junk will divert my arrows away from the creeper in front of me. Okay. Where you go? There you be. Okay. Come on. I want to make you go by. Ra! Can I just, like, destroy you? I actually could. You know what? How much more ammo do I have? Not very much. This is not good, actually. Ra! This is actually really not a very effective tactic. Okay, let's just do this the, uh, boring. Okay, nope. You, you need to not. Stop it. See how this works. Oh, I'm on fire. Okay, so, quickly, I want this on long range. Actually curious, can I hit this? What? No. Oh, hi. Hi. How far does this shoot? Pretty far. Can I snipe that? I really hope I can snipe that. Dang it. <laughs> Not quite. There you go. This is fun. That one missed. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Man. Doink. 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 Now. Doink. Pew. I missed. That's embarrassing. Oh, 
Okay, one of those should blow it up, right? Okay, seriously? There you go. I was about to say, there's no way some of those aren't going to blow that up. Okay, also... Pew! What? Pew! Whee! Let's just hide in here so I can't get, like, obliterated. Okay, you're gonna come over here and maybe fly into the ground. No, you're gonna go away. I'm gonna go one, two, three, four. Do you. You're full. No. Break you. Awesome. Can I, j I can jump out of here, right? Maybe. Wait for you to fly back. Okay. Let me just do... This. Why you no work? Oh, you can't be charged by that. Okay, I should probably not abuse that laser too much since I can't recharge it. Okay. What? Would be. So, that's fully recharged. I can obliterate you guys now. Armor's good. Rah! Die! Ah, most of those missed. It's really not an effective tactic with this amount of power. Or lack thereof, rather. Bang. 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 Hi, you're on fire now. Ah. Rah! Yeah, that's really not an effective tactic. How many do I have left? Six? Okay. I'll probably pay back most of those using the ender pearls I get from here. Pretty much the rest of the episode is just gonna be this, because I have fun with it, so. Whee! Whee! Oh, that was not wise. Let's, let's not go that close to the edge. I got a jetpack, but that doesn't mean I should have to use it. I should also probably be picking these things up. They're useful. Hi. I'm also actually going to switch this out so that I can get to that quicker. Bada boom. Okay, so what I should actually be able to do is I can get up on one of the shorter ones of these. Doing. Not quite. Okay. Doing. Oh, come on. There we go. Hi. Bye. Bye. Ah. Hi. Can you go away for a second? I want to demonstrate something. Oh, or you could just do that. That also works. Can. Okay, seriously, I'm actually trying to demonstrate something. You go away. Go away. I'm actually running out of juice on this laser, so I should just go ahead and take out the rest of these. Not allowed. Not allowed. Hi. 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 All the endermen. Hi. I want your pearls. They are valuable. Okay, so there's still one up here. So that would probably be smart to remove. If I could actually place blocks and remove things. Whee! Not hitting you at all. Whee! Ping. Okay, I think I think there's probably one more. Yeah, maybe. Ah, didn't go anywhere near close enough. Yeah, no. What if I get up on here? Can I get up on this one? Ah, so close. Okay. Can I see you now? And... Bing! Yeah! Any more? There's one more. I cannot shoot that far. And I've only got a couple more shots left, so... I should probably go ahead and take that. Whee! So close. Uh... Yeah, I can make that. If I try hard enough. Ah. Oh, whatever. Wink. Goodbye. 
that all of them? Eat my arrows. Stupid Enderman. You diverted all my arrows. Can you not? Well, fine. You're all gonna get obliterated now. Ah! Those did very little. I should actually start collecting some of these. Not only because they're useful, but they're gonna start causing lag in a minute. That would be bad. Uh, the armor's a little low. I'm actually almost out of arrows now. Uh oh, that's not good. I should actually do something about that. Do I have that hole over here anywhere? Is that over here? Yeah, it is. Okay. Ah. Well, you're dead now. Hi. Okay, where are you? I don't know that he actually can fly through the floor in this one. Uh, so yeah, that's good. That's almost out. Okay, where'd he go? I kind of want to avoid flying, at least for the moment. Destroy all the things. Frankly, this is more fun than just... Come on, stop that. Yeah. Die. Dang it, you're not no, you're not cooperating here. Okay. Well, there's a lot of enemies up here. Bye. Where'd you go? Nope. Stop it. Stop it, dang it, don't knock me off. Okay, none of them were chasing me. Go away. No one wants you. Stop it. Stop it. I want the big one. From a height that hopefully... And those are all completely missing. That is really not a very effective method of firing because it wastes so much. Yeah, that's already almost gone again. Okay. You need to not... Make it not even close. There's actually a lot over here that I could probably pick up. Let's get all the ender pearls. All of them. As I enrage like a whole whole bunch of endermen. Which I should really not be doing because I don't have enough ammo to take care of them all yet. Okay, seriously. I just want your pearls, dang it. Where are you? Okay, I think I'm gonna go ahead and switch over to the jetpack and then annihilate it real quick. So, now that I've got a large horde angry at me, you can all, like, go away and stuff. No. Let's just you know, collect some resources. It's actually pretty efficient, because it takes 14 EMC per arrow, 140 per basically one hit kill shot thing. And then you get 1024 per inner pearl, which is actually a pretty often drop. So, eh. It's pretty good. I'm almost curious if this thing applies fortune. I don't think it does, but it makes sense at least. Okay, there's another one. Here's a couple more. Let's just collect those. Eh, battery's getting a little lower than preferable. These things do use an incredibly large amount of power, so... Yeah, that's the thing to consider when using the quantum armor. Okay. <clears throat> Not good? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Wait for him to fly. Okay, he's not gonna fly. Bye. Ra, ra, 
I want that. Uh, you go in there. Anything else? You. Oh, there we go. Yay. Uh, you. Okay. I can't even get out of there. Okay. Oh. Can he even damage you? I don't think he can damage you in this. <laughs> I really don't. Ah, uh, you're stuck in hole. Huh? Okay, yeah, am I ready to just obliterate him now? Eh, whatever, the jetpack's good. Hey, Ender Dragon. I want to make you go bye-bye. Yeah, let's not use the just uber obliteration thing yet. Ah, this is so stinking disorienting. Okay, I actually don't want him to quite die until he's over the middle of the platform, so come over here. I don't know where I want this thing to be. Come on, a little higher, dang it. Almost. All the way up here. Yeah. Okay, now, come over here. Okay, come over here. Come over here and I'm gonna obliterate you. Okay. Come on. Come on. Come this way. Yeah, goodbye. Let's just make an obliteration of total and complete destruction over here. As it lags to all heck. I am so sorry. I think I killed the game. Yep. And then there's just a rain of horrible terror that literally kills everything. Maha, everything is dead now. Whee! Hi. Hi. I want all of your pearls. Oh my goodness, this is terrible. This is terrifying. Uh, okay. Um, yeah, this might actually be a genuine problem, though. Uh, armor. There we go. Okay. That's, that's better. I wonder how many of these guys I can light on fire at once. Ow. These guys are fast. Oh my. Come on. I need the pearls. I need pearls. I want to get to level 100. I wonder if I can even do that in here. Okay. This is not good. Okay. Let's do something that is probably going to end really badly. Uh, scatter. Okay. I don't think... I don't know if this even has enough power for this, but... I just want to point out that this is what this is good for. Get over here. Okay. Come on. Come on. Over here. Yeah! That was horribly ineffective. Yep, it's out of power completely. Awesome. That didn't last long at all. They're all on fire. Ha 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 ha. Oh, dear me. Okay. That was actually kind of dumb because now I don't have a reliable way of digging holes. Can you not? Okay, come on, 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 come on. Dang it. Come on. This is not being helpful. Okay, come on. Over. Oh, come on. Okay, you know what? You guys all come over here. I'm gonna pick up all these great big orb things because they're orbs and they're cool. Yay, 100. I now is one of the. Come on. Come on. Line up. There we go. Got it. Haha, -ha, safety. Okay, let's just toss those in there. Have, have some of this or something. I don't know. Here, have some of that. There we go. Much better. Okay, this can move. It's useless. Uh, you can go here for the moment. Mm. 
Okay. You know what, basically I just want to see whether... I can lick lure all of them into a hole. Supposedly they won't teleport when they're in a hole. I don't think that's true. Come on. All of you get in the hole. Oh, that was a brief that was a very brief existence on their part. Hi. Okay, I kinda need to get out of here. So if you could not that would be greatly appreciated. There we go. Okay. There goes most of them. Except not all of them. Okay, come on. Are there any of these things left that I missed? Aside from just the carnage of that horrible explosion of awesomeness. Yeah, here's here's just the circle of where they all got obliterated by that. I really wish that wasn't so laggy. Looks really cool when you don't have a lot of them. So yeah, that's the Ender Dragon is gone now. Yep, he gone. He no coming back. That's the end of that basically. So that's pretty much the end of the series. I might stream once or twice, just doing aesthetic things, finalizing parts of the base that I didn't have time to finish. I don't know. We'll see. Probably focus more on portal and then maybe just some random games maybe some minecraft i don't know uh for streams i don't know when i'll be starting a new series probably at some point looking into a quest series but yeah i don't know school is terrible and school takes up time so there's there's that but i hope everyone has enjoyed and if you do come on and check out the rest of my channel this is really the only major long-term thing that's on there at the moment, but there's a couple of other explosions and whatnot. There's an old, uh, or rather new, 1-8 series that I sort of started and then have given up on because I ran out of time. Uh, yeah. There will actually be a stream later Saturday night on the 7th because I... Yeah, I'm sick and I need to sleep, so deal with it. Uh, I think that about wraps it up. I would like to get this dragon egg. So I'm going to do that. Can I, like, hit you with a arrow or something? Can you, like, not all get in the way? Oh, come on. This is annoying. Hit the dang thing. I don't want to fall in. Ra, there you go. Okay. Go away. I don't want you to hit me anymore. Go away. Come on. Okay, here's more carnage. It's actually a really good source of EMC. Come down here. Torch. Tink. Mine. Haha, incredibly large amount of AMC. There we go. Now I can make another one. Because why why not? So yes, on that note, if you liked the video and if you like the series, give the video a like and check out the rest of the episodes along with some of the streams that went along with them. Uh I don't know if I'll do something else with this, uh, maybe. Uh comment if you had a comment. Like if you liked the video. And subscribe if you like what I do. Thanks for watching. Yeah, I'll read this one out. I'm incredibly bored. Skip. There's no information at all here. Just me reading it. Oh, I have no water. That is unfortunate. Minecraft. Pop filter. And volume. I see the player you mean. Little dude? Yes, take care. It has reached a higher level now. It can read our thoughts. That doesn't matter. It thinks we are part of the game. I like this player. It played well. It did not give up. It 
is reading our thoughts as though they were words on a screen. That is how it chooses to imagine many things when it is deep in the dream of a game. Words make a wonderful interface, very flexible and less terrifying than start staring at the reality behind the screen. They used to hear voices before players could read, back in the days when those who did not play called the players witches and warlocks, and players dreamed they flew through the air on sticks powered by demons. What did this player dream? This player dreamed of sunlight and trees, of fire and water. It dreamed it created, and it dreamed it destroyed. It dreamed it hunted, and was hunted. It dreamed of shelter. Ah, the human interface. A million years old, and it still works. But what true structure did this player create in the reality behind the screen? It worked with a million others to sculpt a true world in the fold of blah, 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 and create a blah, blah, for the blah, 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 in the blah, blah. It cannot read that thought. No, it has not reached reach the highest level. That it must achieve in the long dream of life, not the short dream of a game. Does it know we love it, that the universe is kind? Sometimes, though, through the noise of its thoughts, it hears the universe, yes. But there are times that it is sad in the long dream. It creates worlds that have no summer, and it shivers under a black sun, and it takes its sad creation for reality. To cure it of its sorrow, we would destroy it. The sorrow is part of its own private task. We cannot interfere. Sometimes, when they are deep in dreams, I want to tell them that they are building true worlds in reality. Sometimes I want to tell them of their importance of the universe, and sometimes in the, when they have not made a true connection in a while, I want to help them to speak to the world they fear. It reads our thoughts. Sometimes I do not care. Sometimes I wish to tell them this world that you take is true. Blah, 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 and that blah, blah, blah. I wish to tell them that they are blah, blah, in the blah, blah. They see so little of reality in their long dream, and yet they play the game. But it would be so easy to tell them too strong for this dream. To tell them how to live is to prevent them from living. I will not tell the player how to live. The player is growing restless. The player is out of breath. <laughs> I will tell the player a no. I will tell the player a story, but not the truth. I probably mixed up the voices. Dang it. No. A story that contains the truth safely in a cage of words. Not the naked truth that can burn over any distance. Give it a body again. Yes. Player. Use its name. Lizzler, dude. Player of games. Good. Dramatic pause. Take a breath now. Take another. Feel air in your lungs. Let your limbs return. Yes, move your fingers. Have a body again under gravity in air. Respawn in the long dream. There you are, your body touching the universe again at every point, as though you were separate things. As though you were separate things. Who are we? Once we were called the spirit of the mountain, father, sun, mother, moon, ancestral spirit, animal spirit, jinn, ghosts, the green man, then gods, demons, angels, poltergeist, aliens, extraterrestrials, leptons, quarks, the words do not change, we do not change. We are the universe. <gasps> we are everything you don't think is you. We are looking at us now, through your skin and your eyes. What does the universe touch your skin that saw a light on you? To see you, player. To know you, and to be known. I shall tell you a story. Once upon, there was a player. The player w the player was you, little dude. S sometimes it thought itself human. On, on the thin crust of a spinning globe of molten rock, the ball of molten rock circled the ball of blazing gas that was 330,000 miles more massive than it. Then they were so far apart that it liked to eight minutes to cross the gap. The light was in formation from a star, and it could burn your skin from 150 million miles. Filling <laughs> Sometimes the player dreamed that it was a miner on the surface of a world that was flat and infinite. The sun was a square of white. The days were short. There was much to do, and the death was a temporary convenience. Sometimes the player dreamed it was lost in a story. Sometimes the player dreamed it was other things in other places. Sometimes these dreams were disturbing, sometimes very beautiful indeed. Sometimes the player woke from one dream into another that woke from that into a third. Inception. Sometimes the player dreamed it watched words on a screen. Let's go back. The atoms of the player were scattered in the grass, in the rivers, in the air, in the ground. A woman gathered the atoms. She drank and ate and inhaled. The woman assembled the player in her body. That's not how that worked, but whatever. 
And the player awoke from the warm, dark world of its mother's body into the long dream. And the player was a new story never told before, written in the letters of DNA. And the player was a new program never run before, generated by a source code a billion years old. I uh, no. And the player was a new human never alive before, never from I, milk and love. I lost that part. You are the player, the story, the program, the human, made from nothing but milk and love. And God, that too. <laughs> you missed that part. Let's go further back. The seven billion 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 billion, billion uh, atoms of the player's body were created long before this game in the heart of a star, so the player chooses information from a star and the player moves through the story, which is a force of information created by mankind. Julian on a flat infinite world created by Marcus then <laughs> Shush. Sometimes the player created a small private world that was soft and warm and simple, sometimes hard, cold, complicated, sometimes it built a model of the universe and instead flex of energy moving through the vast empty spaces, sometimes it called the select electrons of Perdon, sometimes it called the planets and stars. Sometimes it believed that it was in a universe that was made of energy and that what <laughs> energy that was made of offs and ons, zeros and ones, lines of code. Sometimes it believed it was playing a game, sometimes it believed it was reading words on the screen. You are the player reading words. Shush. Sometimes the player reads lines of code on a screen, done that, decoded them into words, decoded words into meaning, decoded meaning into feelings, emotions, theories, ideas, the player started to believe faster and faster, <gasps> and realized that it was alive, it was alive, those sounds of the deaths not been real, the player was alive, you, you are alive, and sometimes the player believed the universe had spoken to it through the sunlight that come through the shuffling leaves of the summer tree, this is too fast, come on, <sighs> and sometimes the player believed the universe had spoken to it through the light that fell from the crisp night sky of winter, where a fleck of light in the corner of the player's eyes might be a star a million times as massive as the sun. Boiling its planets in plasma... <laughs> Good luck. And sometimes the player may believe the universe had spoken through it through zeros and ones, through the electricity of the world, through the scrolling words on the screen at the end of a dream. And the universe said, I love you. And the universe said, you have played the game well. And the universe said, everything you need is within you. No. And the universe said you are stronger than you know. And the universe said you are the daylight. And the universe said you are the night. <coughs> and the universe said through the darkness you fight is within you. And the universe said the light you seek is within you. And the universe said you are not alone. And the universe said that you are not separate from every other thing. And the universe said you are the universe tasting itself taking into itself reading its own code. That's actually bad. That's when the world ends because artificial out that not gonna get on a rant there. And the universe said I love you because you are love. That's also God. And the game was over and the player woke up from the dream and the player began a new dream and the player dreamed again, dreamed better, and the player was the universe and the player was love. You are the player. Wake up.